Bobby, thanks very much. Thanks very much. Good evening, and thank you for letting me come into your homes. <laughs> just, just wanted to say it before you could turn me off. <laughs> Sneaked in there. We've been having a very insane time here for about the last, uh, last few hours. What the heck is that, that doll over there? Can I see that, Dale? Where is Dale? Can I see Dale? Right here, sir. Would the power of the gifty gee is. I'd like to see the gifty. There we are. A child has been lost. <laughs> and that's not all. <laughs> Several things are being lost tonight. What is this, uh, Dale? It's a, a walking and talking doll. Yeah. Oh, yes. It says here, Winnie. <laughs> This is Winnie, the unaided walking and talking doll. But she'll get no aid from me, I can tell you that. Uh, how do you start her walking and talking? Here, could you follow me up at the upper reaches here? Here's uh, let's see if we wind it here. Can you wind it? Right. <laughs> Just polite. Can I take it back over here, Steve? Uh, It'll need a little, well, here. Oh, yeah, maybe you can go out that way. Song pluggers are pretty sneaky. <laughs> will she fall off the cliff? Jack Armstrong will save her. The remarkable thing is that she can talk with this bag on her head. <laughs> I dare say there's not a man jack of us alive today who could do a thing like that. Hello there. Speak. Where do you wind her up? <laughs> She's so lifelike, I feel embarrassed. Or <laughs> like a father all over again. Stop. I mean, once you are, you are. That's it. <laughs> well, this time, don't let him see me moving my lips. <laughs> Go out there, kid, and give him heck. This is your big chance. Here. <laughs> How do you push here? Right? There she goes. for the clip again. Here's Johnny Mac Brown. And now my daughter and I would like to pass the hat. This is wonderful. Who, uh, who made this? Who makes this? Who then... Shut up. Stop with the hand. The Advanced Dial Company. Well, I'd like a small advance from this doll company. Just <laughs> <A> stop. <laughs> Anything I can't stand, it's a Gabby doll. <laughs> I think I just discovered a friend for little Ronald Birdbath. There. Would you uh, put this in the icebox? That's an adorable doll, it really is. That's very cute. Excuse here. <laughs> at the stagehand crying. She slapped him. <laughs> Skitch, let's do a song together. Where are you, yeah. Skitch? Yeah. Hi, Skitch. <laughs> written by Harry Ravel and Matt Gordon. 
And here's a picture that, uh, to play it straight for a second or two, really brings back big, greasy old memories, doesn't it? It's Bing Crosby and Carol Lombard. This is from a wonderful picture called We're Not Dressing. George Burns, and really, that's the title. George Burns and Gracie Allen, Carol Lombard, Ethel Merman, and Leon Errol were in it. And uh, here's the, uh, the big song, I guess, or one of them. There are a lot of good songs for that one. Nice uh, two. Okay. Love thy neighbor, walk up and say, how be you? Gee, but I'm glad to see you. Pal house tricks, what's new? Love thy neighbor, offer to share his burden. Tell him to say the word, you will see him free. Especially, there should be a beautiful girl next door. Say to the girl next door, don't think I won't, but my mother told me to love thy neighbor, and you will find your labor a great deal easier. Life will be breezier if you love thy neighbor. Love thy neighbor. 